Hopefully it's got a decent tutorial as out for walkies when I first started. Yeah, there's a tutorial. Yep. But if you play Slay the Spire, very similar. Firebringer. So this guy's taunting. This gains five power at the end of its turn. Okay. Is he gone? No. Are you gone? Yeah. Yeah? Sweet. Okay. Um, she huh? She gone. She gone. Attack an enemy for 12. Adjacent enemies get six. Gain four block. Bring him into the front and do that. Um, how defensive do we want to be? Let's be offensive. We're going to take a whole bunch of damage here. Ow. Ow. Let me block. Let's gain the 20 block. There. Now you have no power over me. Hey, it's Demon King. What's up? How you doing? Welcome. This place similar to Slay the Spire with two allies? Yeah. The exploration. You know how in Slay the Spire you, you have the dungeon and they're like, do you choose this path or this path? This game expands that into its whole other type of game. Like exploring the map is half of the game in this. And there's all kinds of mechanics about using your inks and paintbrushes to reveal different sections of the book. Um, but other than that, the combat is handled very similar to Slay the Spire. The one key difference is you do have two heroes. The positioning does matter. And they swap back and forth with certain cards. And there's mechanics that deal with that. And then you can summon like little minions too. Yeah. Off work this weekend, so wanted to hang out. Awesome. Welcome. Okay. So we only got this guy left. 20 damage he's doing. If I end turn now, it would, it would go down 18. So I need to do 18 damage. Which I think is fine. Yeah, now we're good. Anything else here we need to do? Any way to heal? I don't think so. Oh, he does. Tastes okay. Good, man. Tastes good, man. Reveal four spaces in a straight line. Okay, so... So here's the map. So they tell you where certain treasures are, but you gotta use your paintbrushes and your inks that you get from combat to unveil the paths to get this stuff. And then when you, if you run out of ink, and you can't, like, expose more of the map, then you gotta go for the boss. Or the elites that are blocking it. So it's kind of interesting. I wonder... Go down here. Oh, there's lava there. I got screwed by the lava. That sucks. I wonder if I can... No, I can't fix all the things I want to fix. Oh, no. 11, 10, 6. Let's go here. That still doesn't do it because of this stupid terrain here. All right. 
We got a gem. Discard a card. Discard a card. All right. Let's just add that to... What should I add that to? I kind of was waiting for other zero cast stuff for this one. After you play it, return it to the top. So that every turn you can get... Something like that. Um... Yeah, I really don't know what to give this to. I'll just do it on this one. I can't believe how hosed I got. I can't get up and around there. Is there another fight I haven't done? Yeah, let's go do the fight. Let's get some more ink. You haven't played Aratus Rabbit? Aratus is sim it's more similar to the Darkest Dungeon than this. But it's Darkest Dungeon where you play as the bad guys escaping the dungeon rather than as heroes trying to rid the evils. Yeah. Flamethrowers. They're only doing one? Okay. How come I'm scared? They have made me scared. Now what happens? Show me how they're dangerous. What? On fire. That's how. At the end of each turn, the hero in this position takes 14 damage. Okay. Well, that's not great. Richie LOL says, Aratus is pretty cool. I think I got like 60 hours. One of the best recommendations I've got from here. Thank you so much. We have, we actually got sponsored to do a bunch of those streams too. Uh, from Daedalic De De Entertainment. Uh... This is the one that grows, right? This one's back. We're gonna get 26 damage for being on fire. Uh. Okay. You have 552 hours in a Rattus? Holy crap. That's some mega hours. Look at this. Look at this ally doing 45 damage now. Alright. This is kind of what we need. That's what we needed. I can't believe how badly I've screwed up getting this tower. They surrounded this tower with mountains, and I still can't get to it. My goodness. I haven't even gotten to show you guys what a page does yet. Um. 
That increases our block. Okay, there we go. We got up to 500 gold, ladies and gentlemen. You know what that means. We can buy something nice. I wonder if Doom is worth getting. You spend a turn doing Doom and then the next 666 attacks on an enemy are crits? Doom! This attacks all enemies for four twice. Attack a random enemy for three. Repeat this. Repeat for each card you've played this turn. This card attacks deal double damage. This card's attacks hit all enemies. What? These, th these things are insane. The first hit each turn deals double damage. That's it. I did it. I did it. I'm not thinking anymore. I just did it. That's going to be great. What the hell is that? A renovator bot? At the end of this turn, return all destroyed enemies to the field. The creature takes 30 damage for each returned enemy. Ah. So we want to kill them as much as we can. Okay, attack all enemies for 30. I think we do that. <laughs> that seems pretty good. Whenever this uh, gains spirit, gain five times as much. For one, you bastard! More. Okay. Wow, see already that trinket that we have that's doubling our uh, stuff. It's putting in some good work. Wish I had another something that can hit everything, but I don't. Gave him 20 blocking. I don't like it. Goodbye, Mr. Burton. There we go. Hey, Paladin, what's going on? You've been looking at this? It's a lot of fun. All right, explosive pigment. Alchemist. Pay 75 gold to transmute a card. Okay. Um, I give you six block, confirm. Attack an enemy for an amount equal to Cypher's rage. Set Cypher's rage to six. Attack all enemies for four twice. And also give it a shard of hunting. What? So we'll also attack the leading enemy for the damage equal to my draw pile? Yes. All for one mana? Yes. Eleven squares get freed up if I go there. What if I go here? Thirteen. Let's do it. Show me thirteen squares. Show me this. What was that? Oh, okay. Yeah. I see. 
Another eye. A lidless eye wreathed in flames. Show me. Interesting. Gold? Did you just show me gold? I like gold. What does the arrow do? At the start of the battle, the equipped hero gains three power for one turn. Eh, I don't think it's worth journeying all the way up there specifically for that. We even made it, Kang, so that we don't even need to do this elite uh, fight if we don't want to. Let's do the normal fight first. Let's see what happens. Oh, this guy looks awesome. Underground boss. I like these rat guys. Underground brigands. All right, so he's going to attack and use a debuff, and these guys are stealthed. an ally impact attack 24 and adjacent enemies take 12 oh I can only do it on him that is less good or I can do this one let's do this one spinning attack actually I can do all three so it doesn't matter that was a great turn great turn great turn everybody go me Now they're defending and buffing. Um, yeah, don't do that. Oh, that's the one that got doubled. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Not great turn, everybody. Not great turn. Whip crack. Whip crack. All right, handled. Nicholas Nicholas Flamel, thanks for following. I hope everything uh, worked out with the Sorcerer's Stone. Thank you for following. Precision inks, three of them. Okay. A, a, a well-placed precision ink can get us over to this gold, though I'm not sure that's so... Actually, no. Yeah. Yeah, we can get... Can I walk on that? I think I can walk on this. Let's do it. And we snag that gold. Okay. See, this game makes the actual exploration and going to the... Going to the encounters in, like, whatever order that you can unlock... A much more interesting mechanic than a lot of these other type games that give you like, oh, which path do you want to take? Um, I think that's like the biggest thing that stands out to me about this game versus others that are like it. Are the darker colored tiles more dangerous? No. Nope. It's just how it looks. This is a more dangerous fight the elite then like this this is a normal battle all right i'm gonna go let's do the elite before we do the boss let's see what we can get i regret everything a blood sprite he's gonna deal 25 molten veins each 20 life blood sprite wait each 20 life blood sprite loses summons a living blood we don't know what that even does. Okay. Living blood. Blood. Oh, right, 
Living blood. The enemy is skipping its turn. When this creature dies, all other creatures gain two power. Okay. I don't like it. Wow, those those little blood dudes. These living blood like counteract my allies, huh? What is the double damage thing? Uh Where is the thing that does the first attack does damp double damage? Is it for both characters? What? Oh, this is it. The first hit each turn. The first hit. So if I do a multiple attack the leading enemy for 22 three times is that really gonna be three oh it's gonna attack this one anyway so screw that let's roll the dice hey i got promote for free nice Look at that, he keeps eating my uh, attacks from my allies. Let's draw some cards. My draw pile is zero. He's doing 42 damage. lot of damage there hopefully we get something big whip crack yeah this is good uh forty five damage it does now he's leaving bye say bye see you later Three, three days in a row. Uh -huh. I have to bring this back when it's clean, too. So, so tomorrow. Stop well, it! You gotta keep the stream going. Four days in a row. Stop it. So fun to see your friends again after the pandemic's over, you know? Or not over, but you know, when it's safer. You know what I mean. I think I'm gonna get hurt real bad here. I think he's gonna... I think our lead guy's gonna die. Four days in a row for what? I, my friend Rex has come over three days in a row now. Two days to hang out, but today to use our kitchen. See that big hit, 45 damage, just got absorbed on the little jerk nose. But we, sur we survived. That would do 40 damage. Interesting how this is working. Hmm. 
Okay. There's no saving him. I could swap. I, I could swap. And then save him, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. So he'll, he'll take the damage. There we go. So he didn't fall down, but he's only got seven life. Which you heard is a 96 hour stream? What? How did you hear that? Pinky Fluff, seriously, you need to get your ears checked. Because I didn't say any of those words. Four days, but it was four days of my friend coming over. How was that turning into a 96 hour stream? <laughs> what? <laughs> I missed something. All right, we got a paintbrush. We got a page. Gauntlet of Might. The equipped hero has plus one power. All right, fine. Very well. Okay, he's almost dead. Oh, they heard four day stream, not streak. Oh, okay. That I can see. Can you imagine bog state after 96 hours? I'd be dead. Um, I still remember when he did the 24 hour stream and he literally started like three different sentences into like one statement. Playing Slay the Spire, a very similar game to this. It was. Yeah, it was great. It was bad. Uh, what's a brush do? Demon King, that's how you explore the map. You have inks and brushes. So like if I wanted to unveil like this one square, I use a precision ink. And if I want to unveil like all of the this, I would use this. So that's how you explore and pick up treasures and fight more encounters. Every encounter that you beat, every like fight that you beat um, will reveal another square. You heard it's four days in my brain. My brain added stream. All right. We'll do. All right. You guys heard it. 96 hour stream. Pinky Fluff willed it into being. All right. I think what we're going to do is going to go for the boss. Let's check our shop. Really need a little bit more gold, don't I? I wonder if I should get Doom. It takes a whole turn to do it. Search TM says, okay, I'm done. The game I'm playing just told me to watch my poop. Interesting. Okay. I have no further questions. I'm going to try to... I lied. I'm going to try to explore a little bit more. Should I do this? I have to heal. Good. You know what? I'm going for the final boss. I'm not going to play around. I ain't playing around. We just healed all the way up. We're going. Let's go for the boss. The Avatar of Greed. The hero's cards cost one more to play. I'm glad I didn't pick up the 666 thing. He's gonna attack and use a debuff. Doomed coin. You cannot draw cards this turn. At the end of the turn, add two Doom Coins to your hand, dissolve. What? Okay, so you gain three mana. I can't draw cards. At the end of the turn, add two Doom Coins to my hand and then dissolve. Okay. That's how we get around his hero cards cost one more to play.
whip crack. Okay, we take two damage here. That's okay. Alright. But then, at some point, isn't my whole hand gonna fill up with... ...doomed coins? Or maybe not. Try to promote one of these guys. Okay, he's up to sixteen. Uh What's dissolved though? It, it does not get put in my deck. It gets taken out of the out of the out of the game. So these cards that get discarded, they go over here, and then when I run out of cards to draw, they get recycled back over. A dissolved card does not cycle back. Yeah. Charge for forty-two damage. Put the Doom card right back in. Uh, okay, first thing we're going to do is the 42 damage. Okay. Let's use one of these, then we'll buckle up. Whirlwind's now free. Here's the problem. Now I don't get cards. Yeah, and I only get three. Oh, that's the problem here. All right, we need this. This, yeah, look at this. We're not getting... Oh man, now I'm all doomed coined. It'd be great if you had some uh, way to use like leftover mana, like if you retained your leftover mana or something. I think my allies are gonna pull out this victory, I'm hoping. But now I don't get any more cards. I get one card. He's dead. All right, so he went down. Now I got a wound. Look, I don't get any cards. you. I'm gonna have all the mana. There. 
Feels <laughs> good, man. Here we go. All right. I got achievements. Complete chapter three. Collect 10 treasures on the map. So that's a complete run. I now have 21 pages. All right, so I never completed a run before. Oh, look at that. He leveled up to four. Oh, he leveled up to four. And this is our party leveling up. What is a review rogue book? Continue. Rage Mind. We unlock new cards for future runs. Draw four cards. Cypher loses life equal to your hand size. Okay. Brimstone Needle. Cypher loses five life. Attacks for 22. Or Dig. Gain 25 gold and then Dissolve. Attack for eight. If you have at least 10 block, attack for 16 instead. Add this to your hand at the start of the game, Binding Topaz. Oh, so you can make sure a card is in your deck at the start of the game each time. That's pretty cool. The eyes follow me. Oh, I got New Run Plus. All right, so here's progression. My heroes, two, four, four, and three. Embellishments. Oh, okay, we have 21 pages. So this is the kind of stuff that changes your runs. So... Extra treasure was visual, visible on the map. I've, I've maxed that out. I started going down this tree over here because I like these. Replace one defend card in your deck with a random card. You can replace one strike card in your deck with a random card. Increase the chance that the replace is of car higher rarity by 3%. Those are pretty cool. Gold piles get 10% more treasure. Hide an additional gem in each chapter. Increase their starting life. Hide an additional... Alright, let's hide an additional heart. Hmm. Unlock an additional talent tier. Let's do it. Additional talent tier. And then I got four more. Thanks for watching, Electrical Messiah. That was my first uh, win. So it's three maps for each one. And now we've got New Run Plus. I don't know what that does. <laughs>